What's up, everyone? This is El Destroyer 229, and welcome back to Let's Play Persona 4. Last time, we continued to go through our stats and social links as things started to be depressing, and then, well, they kind of ended on a bit of a higher note. In this episode, we continue to go through our days as the weather slowly changes. The rain will begin soon, so our deadline is coming up. But we've already saved Nato, so it doesn't really matter. So what are we going to be doing this evening? Well, tonight, we're gonna spend some time with Dojima. Hey, Dojima. Hey. Did you want to talk? Uh. Hmm. Dojima-san? Okay... Sure... <laughs> yeah. Well, that was a pleasant surprise. It was a lot of fun. Certainly caught me off guard there. Hmm. <laughs>
I think I was scared. Scared to have someone else around. I was afraid we'd become a family, and then I'd lose it all again. I was running away by chasing a guy who'd run away himself. It was almost funny. Hmm. Was it hard? Ah. And no one ate dinner that night. You do leave yourself vulnerable whenever you try to open up to anyone, really. Whenever you try to initiate some sort of relationship, there is that vulnerability. It's necessary in order for any relationship to grow. It allows it to become stronger, but it also can lead to heartbreak. By being vulnerable, you do run that risk of losing something, and it can hurt. But that doesn't mean that you shouldn't pursue relationships. It doesn't mean that you should bar yourself away and be alone. People are, well, social creatures. We need each other to provide support, to live. It may be hard, but it's quite a necessary thing in order to go through life. You're welcome, Dojima. Well, that was a pleasant way to spend the evening, and the day moves on to Tuesday. That was a bad pun. By sweating? Well, on average, it's about half a liter. Well, water is essential for life. Please. Yes! 
Aha! Finally! We have now maxed out knowledge. We have moved from professor to sage. Nice! That was what I was most worried about. And actually, I think that leaves... That's everything max except diligence. Sweet! Alright! Well, anyway, time for the revolving door of social links. And since it's raining, it's only gonna be Yumi. Hey! Hey, Yumi. Okay, I'll see if I can make it. Hmm. I can't even imagine just all the stuff that she's going through right now. Well, now it's time for after school, and it's raining. So, our range of social links are going to be quite limited for today. But since we can rank up with Yumi... I'd say we take that opportunity in order to go and do that. So today, we're gonna do exactly that. Hey, Yumi. I am. Were you gonna drop by? I see. Hmm. Useless expression. Hmm? You mean, um, practice is over? I don't think I should try that. that. I don't know, that might seem disrespectful. And still, I'm here for you, Yumi. By the way, it actually doesn't matter what you responded for that or the first option.
wanted to run away from all of that. I wanted to look the other way from my entire life. that Yumi just take your time and think about it I'm sure you'll find an answer to it <laughs> you can also respond with don't stress over it don't stress over it and you'd still get the same amount of points has its many forms and different lengths of time to overcome it. For some people, they just need time alone to think about the events that led up to the cause of grief. But for others, they need someone there in order to help them through it. Whether it's just another opinion or even just as simple as just being in their presence sometimes people just don't want to be alone and this is one of those times oh see you later all right i'll see you around yumi Well, that was heavy. Oh, welcome back. Aw, thanks, Nanako. All right, so what exactly are we going to be doing this evening? Well, we have another social link that we can raise up. So today, we are going to go and tutor. Useless expression. In some cases, that's just how it is. As terrible as that may be. <laughs> I suppose that's true.
Hey, don't act like you're the only one. I mean, truth be told, school is pretty important. But... yeah. <laughs> Sometimes it can feel like an absolute pain. Well... yes. <laughs> There's another problem with that, but that is true. <laughs> Maybe not. certainly understand the thing with learning another language and it's really I don't know it's really iffy in terms of learning other languages within a curriculum I spent three years studying Spanish in high school and one year in college studying Japanese and with Spanish even though I took three years of it I can honestly say I didn't learn a thing. It was something that I was supposed to do, and quite honestly, I learned enough to do well on the tests and just get good grades. When it came to Japanese though, even though I'm not fluent in it, it was something that I was actually quite interested in, and I did learn quite a bit about it. Mostly when it comes to just basic stuff like hiragana and katakana, Though not kanji, screwed kanji. The writing system, not the character. So, especially with language, there is just a desire. You, w If you really want to learn a language, you have to have that drive. It can't just be something that you're obligated to do. And while I feel that's most applicable to other languages, it is also other applicable to other aspects within school and in life in general. If you want to learn something, with enough dedication, you will learn it. But if you don't give a damn, then you're just not going to give a damn. All right, thanks, Shu. Please come back again. I will. And more money for us. And thus it moves on to Wednesday. <laughs> because you're you, Yosuke. Also, you're hopeless. And it's because the pigment ages.
No problem, Yosuke. And yes, midterms are coming up. Though that wasn't the reason why I wanted to get knowledge maxed out so quickly. It was a reason. I mean, I did want to max out knowledge before we had midterms. But it wasn't the reason why I wanted to max it out so badly. <laughs> oh well, it will become a it will become apparent eventually. And well, classes are over for today. Now today is actually rather important. Today is the last day that you have to rescue Nalto. If Naoto's not out of the TV world by the end of today, then the fog will come over and she will die. So if you haven't rescued her, now's the day to do so. But thankfully we have, so we're, we don't have any problems. Now what exactly are we going to be doing today? Well today we actually don't really have much that we can do. However, since it is raining, Ah, uh, oh, actually, I have not checked the vending machine, have I? I have not! Oh, clumsy of me. Let's get some sodas first. Alright, and since it's raining, we can get some discounts over at Shiroku. I don't think we really used up too many items in our last exploration. So I don't think there's really going to be too many items that I'm really going to need to buy. We'll get another antibiotic gel, just to max out on that. Um... Royal jellies, just to have that up to 10. Uh, mouthwash, just to get that up to 10. Uh, go homes, just so that's up to 10. And vanish ball, so that's up to 10. So mostly just topping off what we already had. Uh, ointments, I think we're good on just the six? Alright, I think we're probably good with all that. There's not really too many reasons to really go beyond just having that safe spot. But it is still good just to have it at that level. Because you never know when you're gonna need it. So now that it's raining, what exactly are we going to be doing today? Well, we do still need points for some of our social links, and since there's no social link available today, we are going to go and pray at the shrine. So what social link are we going to be praying for today? Well, for once, it's not someone from outside of school. This is actually going to be a female student. Today we are going to pray for Yumi. She could certainly have some prayers in order to help her find her answer. And that's all we're going to get for today. And now it's evening. ended on a wet note as rain clouds moved into the area. As a result, a thick fog is expected to form in the Inaba region later tonight. Way to use the same voice clip considering it's the middle of the week. But at any rate, yes, the fog will roll in. So, like I said, if you haven't rescued Naoto, it's too late now. Let's go ahead and check the fridge real quick. Oh my, there's actually something in here. There's a peach of shortcake covered with a huge blob of whipped cream. I don't want to chance it. I also don't need to chance it because we don't need courage. I'm willing to bet that like the whipped cream is like actually like cottage cheese or something like that. Or maybe it's past the due date. I don't know. I'm not going to chance it. At any rate... We're going to go ahead and call it a day right here. It's a little bit soon, but, well, considering the different trends that we've had throughout the game, I think you all know what's going to happen next. Plot stuff! So, like I said, that'll do it for us here. 
So, next time on Let's Play Persona 4. We're gonna head up into our room and watch the Midnight Channel. Since it is raining, we should check on that. Just to make sure nothing strange has happened. We've already gone through too many what-ifs and things that weren't quite matching what we were expecting. I.e. King Moron. So let's make sure that nothing appears on the Midnight Channel like usual. So until next time, everyone, take care.